Hello guys, this is Eric Cotty Center. My greetings to everyone watching me. And I send my big appreciation and my greetings to you guys for supporting this channel, hit 10,000 active subscribers, which is a massive improvement. And I really appreciate you guys. So if you haven't yet subscribed to Eric Center, make sure to hit the subscribe button and click the notification bell to stay updated because we have a quality video content on diluted content the question is what is a multimeter a multimeter is an instrument designed to measure electrical current like ohms resistance and then voltage this is the basic unit of multimeter and how to even use multimeter is also one problem to some of people out there so this guy i think he definitely want to know the purpose of multimeter so this is your answer if you are watching me it is designed for electrical instrument which is used to measure current voltage and resistance that is all i'm going to show you how to use this multimeter and we are going to use it to test two pin ignition coil okay so first of all i have my multimeter here this is for beginners if you want to know how to use the multimeter this is how we are going to use it here as you can see this is for resistant for resistant we have ohms here this is for ohms and here we have amps amps we have voltage here and here we have milliamps so all these ones are milliamps all these ones are milliamps so what you're going to do is we are going to set our multimeter to the ohms position and we have two coils here this square is for densu if you can see it well yeah this is densu ignition coil which is three pin and we have kia this is for kia as you can see this is for kia uh -huh. this is for care and it's a two pin ignition coil so we are going to test it we are going to test it for you to see whatever it is we are going to get an answer let me put this thing here a sub okay so all the quests will be going to align here before i'll do that let me do it this way yes then the multimeter is set to home position let me test it but one thing i always want you to know that with this multimeter we have negative negative and positive here is the voltage ohms so this signal is the voltage signal or ohm signal ohm signal then we have at the same time resistant then we have com com which is negative so these are the implications you have to know when you are about to test ignition coil so it's working you can see 0 0.11 that means the multimeter is working and i'm going to test this thing so anytime the first pin here is the negative why the right pin is the positive the right pin is the positive there and uh, 
left wing is the negative so most of these advanced engines are all two pin that is why i'm testing it so let me test it just as i said we have negative and positive so i'm going to test it and figure out you can see this ignition coil is not good because it's supposed to 0 0.01 it's supposed to 0, 0.0 and this is 0 0.12 there is no continuity at all this ignition coil is faulty because every good ignition coil is supposed to be 0 0.01 or 0 0.02 that means there is a continuity so as soon as you test the ignition coil ohms or resistant and it gives you 0 0.14 0 0.11 0 0.13 0 0.11 0 0.12 whatever that means this ignition coil is 40 and at the same time i can check it this way for you if you have a socket you can plug it to the negative then you put it in here and it will give you 5.09 this is the voltage that means it has low voltage and this ignition coil cannot work at all and we are going to test the three pin ignition coil too this is the three pin ignition coil and this coil is good so what we normally do is the left pin is the what negative the middle pin is the trigger wire which is from the ecu and then the what right pin the first pin is from the battery supplier which is the positive so we are going to test the ohms or the resistance so in this case this is a three pin wire so you have to turn the multimeter to mainly what 200 milliamps 200 milliamps 200 milliamps as you can see so that it can give you the exact figure you want so let's check this one too and see if it can give us a positive what what okay